air vehicles. The government spokesperson Kano Sarasoguna says that COVID-19 is still a danger, hence the need for PSV operators to obey all safety protocols in the transport sector. The Ministry of Health has in the meantime embarked on mass COVID vaccination exercise targeting workers at the export processing zone. A day after the government allowed public service vehicles to resume full passenger capacity carriage, the government is cautioning the operators against carrying excess passengers. In a tweet, government spokesperson Cyrus Oguna called on passengers to speak up against those overloading their vehicles. Oguna said complacency in the transport sector may negate efforts made in combating the disease. Meanwhile, vaccination of the first batch of workers at the Export Processing Zone Authority kicked off Tuesday. The EPZA board says the move is aimed at protecting the over 16,000 workers, majority of whom live in Kitengela and at the river towns. In EPZA, we have a lot of our staff who are engaging with a lot of people from uh, our investors, and it's important that uh, we get them secured. And then since uh, we, as uh, the government has availed to us vaccines, we are uh, not limiting it only to our people. We, because we have a large number of workforce, the investors are also technically our people. Wale staff wetu na wale staff wafanya kazi wale wengine wanafanya kazi na wa, uh, wa investors wale wengine. Ndiyo tuweze kuwa kikisha kuwa tumefuatia zile sheria za serikali zile wameweka kuambatana na kuzuia kuoneza hii ugonjwa wa COVID. Nancy Okwari, Prime Edition.